So we have a question from I'm Emily. She asked, if Ellen didn't learn sign language, would you still be with her? Her, me. Sorry, that's a heavy question. I don't want to interrupt your answer. You also dated someone else before me, and they didn't really learn sign language, and that only lasted a little bit, right? No. I read somewhere that I talked about deaf centered or deaf and hearing relationships whether they're deaf deaf focused or hearing focused relationships and it was an article saying that deaf focused deaf and hearing relationships always outlast yeah hearing focused deaf and hearing relationships that's a mouth that's a lot to sign but Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I think I can find it. I'll leave it in the description down below. It explains a little bit. It's not really a long article though. It was more like like three paragraphs. That's it. Yeah, it was really simple. But it makes sense. It makes sense. trying to get my attention we have a bonus question prize um question from bentley could you explain when you use initialized signs as shortcuts 
like for example high school for high school I looked up on um, life print you guys can I'll leave the link down below you guys can check out the description that I found about initializing so that means for example um, the sign for family starts has the hand shape of the first letter of that word so F family, group, class, yeah, room, but sometimes it can be um, not as common in ASL because it's more, yeah, English or C. The question is when are signs that are initialized accepted or not accepted? So it's usually accepted if it has been around for a long time and people of past generations have used it. Um, family is one of those signs. Uh, another reason why uh, a sign would be accepted would be if it was, if it took less effort to sign and then slowly got integrated into mainstream signing yeah mainstream I, I signed integrated integrated into mainstream a good example of that one would be a uh, breakfast or breakfast so instead of signing two signs that requires a lot more effort um, food morning was it morning food food, morning, morning, food, two signs, you can just sign breakfast with a B, breakfast. Same with lunch, dinner, sorry, breakfast, breakfast. I still sign breakfast, yeah. But I sign lunch, dinner, instead of noon food and night food. Dinner, lunch, breakfast. These are signed lunch or dinner. So those have been um, slowly being integrated. Yeah. I didn't either. Yeah. So you guys can learn yourself too. I'll leave the link down below. You guys can check it out. And... Oh, 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 oh. Um, Brian and I have been trying to screen print and we finally just were successful. guys we have new um tank tops in um that say sign fam if you guys want to order them uh go to our sign duo shop that has a link in the description down below and there's only a few so if you guys want one i would order one soon we <laughs> yeah we've been trying to learn how to screen print and we finally just figured figured it out and so you guys should be expecting more s merch to be coming soon yeah we 
we tried Teespring too and the printing was just kind of off. It wasn't that great. So, I don't know. That was our experience. Yeah, but these... What? Oh yeah, they're just for sale. If you guys want one, let <laughs> get one. We only have a few because we're just starting to make our own and screen printing our own. So it's like we're testing the waters, you know? But this one, this tank top is really nice quality. I like, I use it myself. I have one that doesn't have this and I have this one too. But um, I have just one without it and I use it all the time. Thank you guys so much for watching our videos. We really appreciate it. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye.